Ooh, this is different. Hello everyone and welcome back to Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. The continent of Tellius. Blessed by the goddess, to the northwest lies the land of Crimea, home of the Grail mercenaries. Without warning, Crimea's eastern neighbor, the Kingdom of Dian, launches an attack on Crimea's capital city of Milior. Ike leads a handful of mercenaries to Melior to confirm Soren's news of the attack. En route, they happen upon a young woman, unconscious but unharmed. Fearing for her safety, they take her to their stronghold. This girl, right? Princess. When she awakens, the woman gives her name as Alincia and lays claim to the title of Princess of Crimea. She relates the sad tale of her flight from Crimea and of her parents' murder at the hands of Ashnard, King of Dian. The Grail mercenaries answer Princess Elysia, Elis Elincia's plea for help and agree to escort her to the Kingdom of Galen. Located to the southwest of Crimea, Gallia is home to the Lagus, a race quite unlike Ike and his fellow Beorg. Hmm. Oh, wolves, tigers, panthers, whatever. Yeah, those are panthers. Crimea and Gallia have long struggled to overcome their differences. In recent years, the two kingdoms have done much to ease the prejudice between the Lagus and Beorg factions. Their combined efforts have forged a bond of trust and friendship that may yet overcome years of intolerance. Ike and company escape the Dian army, abandoning their longtime base. From there, they begin the long march toward Gallia. Their task clear and their destination far, they slip into an ocean of trees. And that's where we stand right now. Chapter 6, A Brief Diversion. So last time... We cleared that mission that I was having trouble with. Jesus, why does it have to be so blamed humid? If we, were, if we weren't being traced, I'd strip off this armor here and now. Then I'm almost glad we are being pursued. I suppose you'll have to grin and bear it, won't you? <laughs> I suppose I will. Right, so enough of your gripping. You're merely wasting energy. Still, this heat is appalling. Dense forests such as, these, such as these are not made for us delicate humans. The subhumans love them, though. These subhumans, are they really so different from us? What, you mean to tell me you've never seen a beast man before? No, never. Well, I have. They're a hairy bunch, I tell you. And ugly as a sin, too. Their faces are all fangs and whisker, their claws are like daggers, razor sharp and deadly. And even though they can speak our language, they're beasts through and through. Savages, everyone. Are there more than one type? The ones Shinon calls subhumans can be divided into three groups, each named for its physical characteristics. First, the beast tribe, next the bird tribe, and finally the dragon tribe. They are traditionally called Lagos. The Lagos tribe res residing here in Gallia is the Beast tribe, who possesses those feline qualities of which Shinon spoke. To the south are the islands where the birdmen live. The dragons are in Goldua. It's something every merchant should know. Looks like you know even less than I give you credit for, Ike, my boy. <laughs> huh. Perhaps. A little farther and we'll be out of the trees, Ike. Really? That means Gallia proper. Compared to this forest, even a kingdom of half-breeds will seem like heaven. Alright. Well. A hey, villain time.
and that's when we lost track of them. I assigned a squad to pursue them and return so I could give you this report. Understood. You may step down. That train reminds me so much of, like, your typical Super Sentai villainess from, like, you know, Shimurana from Mega Ranger. You know the type. <laughs> she makes me think of those. So Princess Elencia is making her way through the forest to Gallia. Aina! It appears your advice was sound. Well done, you have earned my praise. Thank you. When the king assigned me a tactician, I wondered what I had done to lose his trust. When I saw it was a young girl, I burned with anger at the king's judgment. Still, it worked out better than I had expected. Keep up the good work. Of course. Now then, it's time for the hunt to begin. Alright, it's time. Can I... I think we're gonna run into enemies now. Hold it right there, everyone. We're coming into the edge of the forest. Form up. Form up. Combat positions. I don't suppose our dying pursuers were willing to let us just slip away. There is no doubt they will attack again. Without knowing their numbers, it is difficult to advise a course of action. Take your best guess, Soren. With the limited information we have, what is the best way to proceed? Some of our group cannot fight. If we are caught, we'll have a difficult time defending them and attacking the Dyans. I propose we separate into two groups. A small fighting force to engage the enemy and buy the main group some time. And the rest of us, who will escort the princess to Gallia at full speed. Do you want to divide our combat strength? The main force aside, don't you think the risk to the smaller group is too high? I believe this is the only way to achieve our goal and keep casualties to a minimum. It's possible there's an ambush waiting for us at the edge of this forest. If we proceed with no plan, we may we may be caught between the pursuit of the and the ambush, which would be the end of us all. Looks like we've no choice but to give it a go. Alright, let's split up. The divisionary team will be me, will be Gaitri, Shinon, and me. The rest of you guard Princess Lindsay and proceed to Gallia straight away. Got it? Are you sure you're taking enough men? The idiot, pup. Smaller numbers mean better mobility. Your time would, better be, would be better spent worrying about yourself than us. Man, I'm not gonna have Gaitri and Shinon on my side this battle. Oh no. That's bad. I relied on them so much these last few times. Listen up, this will probably prove to be the biggest fight the company's ever faced. Remember, you've got you've only got one life. I don't want any of you dying on me. In times like these, it matters not what our blood ties are. We are family. Hey, that's nice. If you don't want to cause your family any grief, then live! I will be commanding the main force. Titania, you are his support. Alright, let's move out. See you all in Gallia. Alright. Here we are, Gallia border. Okay, there's bridges this time. There's a bunch of enemies there. We can hide in the bushes this time, or the trees. So they're waiting for us after all. There are more of them than I'd imagined there would be. Yep, there always are. I thought they would have been spread across the forest border. I didn't expect to see so many in one place. Do we rethink our strategy? No, we have already been split up. It's too late to reconsider now. Isn't there some way we can get at least the Princess Mist and Rolf to the far shore safely? Wait, why are they here? Oh boy. There are two bridges. This thicket extends to the edge of the water and most the westernmost bridge. Water. The westernmost bridge. Wait, no, we cannot have Mist and Rolf in battle. They're not strong enough. If we can use the trees as cover, we might be able to reach the bridge undetected. From there, we can launch a surprise attack. We'll be creating a diversion, right? Correct. While we keep the enemy's attention, the princess and the others can cross the bridge to safety. So we have to send Ike, Oscar, and Soren, and Titania to go distract the enemies. And then we get the princess to cross the bridge. Alright. We've no time for discussion, that's the plan to go with. My lord Ike, I... I will fight with you! No, you won't. <laughs> My lord? 
I cannot let you expose yourself to danger of any kind. Everyone here is risking his life to ensure your safety. If you understand that, you'll cooperate and do as I ask. I see. I will do my part. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's settled, then. Right, let's break through their lines. Mist, Rolf, take care of the princess. Do not let yourselves be seen. Oh boy, it's a stealth mission, huh? Right, be careful, everyone. Leave it to us, Ike. We'll just pretend it's a game of hide-and-seek. I never lose at hide-and-seek. Alright, let's do that. So, okay, they're leaving. Everyone ready? Let's go. Okay. Who do I have? Ike, Titania, Soren, Oscar, and Boyd. Alright. Alright, we'll see how well this works. It's time. Escape. What is this about? Missions by team from battle, let's run how. In this battle, you'll earn a victory if Ike reaches the escape point, which is those yellow squares there. Okay, so we have to get to the place. Okay, good. I get it. I got it. Ike isn't the only guy who can escape, by the way. Your fighting companions can also make a run for it. But as soon as Ike goes, the mission will end. Here, I'll show you. Let's send Ike's friend to the exit. Bam, bam, bam. So, escape. The escape command will appear whenever a unit moves to a certain escape point. To an escape point. If you select escape and then choose yet, yes, the unit will leave the battlefield. Alright. See how the ballot is see how the battle's still going? That's because Ike is there. So I let your eyes free, you ask? Well, I can't say too much, but something nice might happen if your allies escape. Ooh, mysterious. Anyway. Now I'll let Ike escape and learn myself a victory. There's that escape command again. Let's choose it and then confirm that we want to leave. That's it! I satisfied the escape condition and cleared the map. So it's time for the next fight. That's all there is to escaping! What? Oh, don't be so macho. Everyone has to flee sometimes. I do not want to see this again. Alright, I got it. So where's the escape point here, anyway? <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, who's this guy? He's... Wait, they're all... This guy's level 2? Huh. Wait a minute. Oh, wait, these guys... Oh! Oh, okay, then. Well... We're a little bit under-leveled. I don't know how I could have fixed that, though. So these are soldier the avalances. Maybe we should keep going in uh, the bushes. Actually, we could spread out a little bit. We could, maybe we could try skipping these enemies entirely. And just go straight for... Straight here, this way. Right? Try this now. Oh boy, okay. Wait to play equipping weapons? No, I don't need that. I know how to do that. Yes, I'm pretty sure I do. So yeah, as long as we're hiding in here, the enemies will not spot us, I don't think. On moving. All right, we'll, we'll be out of the bushes soon. One more. So there's an enemy right there. Can't I see you make it over? Yeah, okay, we'll just, we'll go, we'll keep, we'll stay in the bushes a little while longer, I think. Just, just in case. Oh, 
One more player phase. Alright, let's go. So now we can actually attack. Oh yeah. I can attack this guy. Let's try out the steel sword, because we haven't really used it much. Ooh, I like this scenery on the bridge. Okay, that after that worked, I guess. Good. And then Boyd can hopefully finish this dude off. Right? Maybe. Actually, hang on. Can Titania... I feel like I should use Titania for this guy first, because then if Boyd is there, Titania won't be able to move. So I'm gonna put Titania over here. Kill this guy, hopefully. Oh, somebody who didn't die immediately. Enemies are getting stronger and we're getting weaker. Oh no. Okay, so anything else? I will keep Sword in the bushes, because I don't think... I don't, I don't know if Sword's gonna be much help here. We've spotted the mercenaries! You there! Inform General Petrine at once! Request that you gather the troops! Yes, sir! Alright. Enemy phase. Oh, they're not attacking. Oh... Are we done for... Oh no, how much damage does this guy do? Okay, oh, not much, surprisingly. Oh, but uh, Boyd didn't do much damage either. Oh, this is gonna be a tough one. Ha, <laughs> you dare go against Titania? At least we still have this on our side. Titania's superpower. Player phase. Okay, we we have to gang up on this guy. It's the only way. Sorn still can't make it here. Alright, it's fine. Oscar, go over here. Attack this guy. We'll do a triple attack to see if we can kill him. No damage. Oh boy. This is gonna be a lot tougher than I thought. Uh, go back, buddy. Void. Please. Let's see if he can do this. Do some damage. Oh, that hardly did anything. Oh, he, that was not that was stronger. All right, well, that's not good. Miss. Jeez, what is with this guy? Oh, did it level up? Oh, thank you so much. I don't know if Titania can even make it. You know what? I... Oh no. Now we have the only- nope, there's nothing we can do. We have to go for it. We have to just go for it. This isn't gonna work. But we don't have a choice. Darn, she actually damaged him. Okay. Now. We just have to rely on hope. We just have to hope and pray that he doesn't go after. I he will. Ike's dead. We lose this one. Darn it. We lost this one. Yep, Ike's gone. Oh well. I'll try again. I'll try again.
All right, let's do this again. Um, what conditions? Hang on. Yeah, victory terms. No, wait. Victory terms where... Yeah, escape. So, really, um... We just, we just have to find a better escape route. Could this be a better path? It might. Sour Marmite is here, though. But this is better. This is better than the other one. Definitely the better of our options. So we're gonna go in the bushes. Go through the bushes as much as we can. And then see if we can sneak up on some enemies. Soren, please keep up. Alright, one more. So now we can actually attack. Should I go straight for this guy? Probably. He has a bow, so he's gonna be harder. Maybe I shouldn't have wasted the steel axe on that. Oh well. Uh, go over here now. Yeah, let's have Oscar finish this guy off. Level up. We can actually reach level 5, oh my god! After 5 level 4s, he finally got to 5. Whew. This. Hopefully this isn't a bad decision to have miss. Oh, are you kidding me? You really just have to miss that hike. this again. So these guys are still moving. Oh no. I was gonna throw it. Oh. Come on. Are you kidding me? Ike, you better not die immediately. Oh. Here we go. It's happening. It's happening. Okay. So. How do we go about this? Basically, Ike has to stay in the bushes. You know what? I'm willing to do a Titania solo mission if that's what it takes. Because honestly, I think she can at least at least have her knock out these first few enemies and maybe these guys. Who knows? Soren, come this way. Alright, player phrase again. Alright, Titania. Your turn. I'm not sure she's gonna kill anyone, but at least she won't die. <laughs> oh, wait. Please. No, oh, she didn't kill. Alright. Let's have Oscar finish this dude off. Level 5 for the second time, here we go.
Okay. I should probably start taking the weapon triangle into consideration as well, because swords are not good against lances. So, I use Boyd against this guy, not Ike. Soren, can you do anything? You can attack from here. So hopefully that'll do something. Bam! Nothing! Oh, miss. Okay, good. Attack again. Good, good, good. Damage. Damage. Nice. That's good. We can use... Please, as long as Ike doesn't miss, we can kill this guy. There we go. He's out. Yep, this again. So, enemy phase. So, there's an archer there. He'll, he'll, all right, he's only gonna shoot once. Not gonna kill. Not gonna kill. It's fine. It's okay. These guys cannot reach yet. All right, here goes. Let's have Oscar hopefully take out the archer here. Nope, miss. Oh, well, we got one. So that's nice. Stay where you are. Surround him. Wait, surround the archer. Stop him from being able to attack from anywhere. Maybe not Soren yet. No, you know what? No, I'm fine with that. We can do this. We can do a Soren here. Boom. Oh, another one. Boom, dead. We don't even have to surround him. Go Soren. And level up. Resistance is very good for him, because Soren is the type that dies very easily, as I've seen already in this game. So, we should put... let's get Boyd over here. Wait, is this guy in range? Hang on, is this dude in range? He's in range of Soren, we gotta get someone to protect him. Yeah, let's put Void over here, because he's not going to die immediately. Like, Actually, ooh, shove Soren out of the way. Bam! Alright. Now I have to attack this one. Miss. And dead. I never get tired of seeing Titania kick butt. And now you go over here, protect Zorn further. Ike, you should probably go in the bush. No, go behind this thing here. Distance, distance yourself from enemies. So he's gonna go after Boyd, which is fine. See? It's alright. Okay. Test out Soren's new found power. His new level. And another one. Alright. Soren's getting good. Okay, so we're just gonna. Otherwise, I think we should probably take this time to heal people, so. Void, have a vulnerary if you still have one. Only one? Oh man. We need more stuff. Ike doesn't have anything, does he? Make your speed for her, Saya. Saya, they keep for her.
so... Oh man, Oscar's got pretty good movement range right now, but I don't think... Honestly, I'm good with ending the turn here. I think we're fine. Ike can't... Unless... Wait a minute, trade. Trade with Ike. Wait. Yeah, trade Vulnerarius with Ike. So he can heal. Alright, and that's I think that's good enough. Put Titania here in front. So if any enemies show up, she can deal. Or not. Alright. Alright, now we move forward. Not shove Boyd? Alright, fine. And put Sorn in here. Alright, time. Can this guy reach? <laughs> he can't! Oh, that's awesome! Okay. That's really good, actually. What weapons does, does he have? Does anyone have a javelin? Okay, idea. Idea. Trade her javelin. Give it to him. There we go. She has the pole axe now, which is good. So, here. How much. How strong is the pole axe? It's not as good. But it's a good against knight's effect? What does that mean? Maybe. It, yeah, it might be good against. Armored Knight. It's good against Horse Knights. I don't know how good it'll be against this one. Oh, pretty good apparently. Okay. Oh, and you're dead. Nice. Well, that went better than expected. Sweet. We got past that guy. So now uh, we keep moving, I guess. Let's try not to get too close to the other enemies. Sorn, stay behind, Boyd over here, there we go. Let's see if we don't get too close to the other enemies. Yeah, they can't reach. Awesome. Um, Alright, I'll just go over here. Titania could reach an enemy. Oh, a mage? Yeah, it'd be useful to take this guy down, probably. He has wind magic, he has a staff. Is, the, is this guy a healer? I think this guy heals. Okay, hang on. It's probably a good idea to try and take this guy out as soon as possible. It's using, uh, I don't want to be wasting the poleaxe and um, other non-important enemies. Ooh, crit! Awesome, awesome. Destroy the healer immediately. There we go. Uh, okay, yeah, go back. So, Titania is there, stuck there with the enemies now. Let's not let the others get too awful close. Titania can handle herself. So let's just do that. Soren, yeah, stay. Let's make the, let's do the square. Oh, they're moving. They're moving. Yep. Alright, win magic. How good is Titania against magic? Actually no. Oh no, pretty good. Let's go. No, Titania's fine. She's, she's gonna stand there. Titania's just gonna stand there. She is our shield. Our unbreakable shield who destroys and defends everything. Uh, yeah, we can take care of this guy, I think. Hopefully. I don't know if Oscar's gonna be able to beat her. Oh. Okay, well, that could have gone worse. You have to run now, though. Oh, he can't really. Hmm. Well. 
We have other characters. Let's keep trying to attack this guy. Don't miss this time, boy. Bam. How good. How strong. Okay. We have one more shot at killing this guy. I... Yeah, let's use... Wait, Soren's got mad. Yeah, Soren can attack this dude. Oh, he can't reach! Wait. I think... Darn it, he can't reach. Alright, fine. It'll, ha it'll have to... <laughs> Ike will have to do. Regal sword. He's good against knights and armor, neither of which are this guy, so we're just gonna use the steel. Make sure we kill this guy, please. Don't miss. Alright, good. He's gone. Ike level up. Awesome. Amazing. Perfect. Give me some good stat boosts. Okay. Well, that wasn't very good. That's fine. Titania. Wait, Sorn. Get over here with the rest of us. Titania. Um... Titania? Attack. <laughs> We're just gonna have Titania stand here in the middle of the enemies. Hopefully they'll all go after me. Or her. Woohoo, level up for Titania! What level is she at? Four? Good stuff. Speed is good. Yeah, it's just making Titania even more OP, sure. That works. We're not letting- I'm not putting Titania on the escape block. What's this? They're not bad. Let's go, man. Hit those mercenary scum with everything you have. Oh, here we go. Wait! What? He just attacked way farther than I expected. Oh no, that was that guy, right? Try me. <laughs> Who's next? Dead. Dead. Titania might be a little too strong. I feel like she kind of takes away <laughs> some of the challenge. Put Sora over here. It's not like any other. Okay, this guy can't reach. Oh, whoops. Um. Well, I'll hopefully take this guy out. Alright. And no, don't go to the put Titania in front of this guy, see if they attack her. Otherwise, everyone move not too far. How far can this guy move? Yeah, so everyone just stay where you are basically. Maybe like a little more to this side. Hang on, let me see. Oh no, he can reach Soren. That's not good. In position to attack Soren. And that's it, luckily. That's it. Good. Alright. But he's not gonna go after Soren, because Soren's way too far away, of course. Try me! I'll not let even a single soldier get past. Oh, okay, he actually damages her. He can actually damage her. Alright. Well. But the only one here who can actually even get close to Titania is the boss. So it's not like we're in trouble here. <laughs> oh, well, wow, okay. That's a different animation we haven't seen before, I don't think. Oh, 
Okay, this might actually be bad. This guy might be a problem. Not much of a problem, but a problem nonetheless. Okay, play your face. Um, I think we should go help her out. Oh, I don't want- I'm really scared to put- Hang on. Can I- I'm gonna go with the Polaxe against this dude. I'll do it. As long as we can get this guy out of here. Oh. Oh yeah, we can do this. Hang on. Alright, let's get Titania a bit farther away. No one else can reach, so enemy phase. Guys, come closer. Oh, okay, he doesn't regenerate much. It's fine, it's fine, not a problem. Yet. Alright, now we can start what, taking down these guys. Soren, can you? I trust you to take out this soldier. Not take out, but maybe like damage at least somewhat, please. Oh, that didn't go. Well. Oh no. Yeah, that was not good. Either. Luckily, I don't think so. I don't think we're lost here. Um. Yeah, let's have Oscar go over here and take out what remains of this guy, please. Actual. Yeah. Go with this one. Please kill, please kill, please kill, please kill. Come on, okay, good. Okay, if you left him up one damage, one health. Alright. Nice. Problem now. Alright, we're gonna try going. To... Can all of you guys reach? Can. Alright, so we're gonna go down. So that the other two can still attack. I'm not taking any risks with this guy. I'm not... Oh wait, Titania just kills him immediately? Imagine, imagine. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, perfect. Alright, now let's go uh, out of range of this guy. He's gonna stay where he is. Yeah. So, Titania. Attack. Come on, we're this close. Just la this is the last guy, and then we win. Boom. Ow. Okay, we can take this guy out. Come on. We can take him out. Ike can take him out. I'm sure. What's the weapon triangle like, by the way? Oh, armor! Regal sword's good against armor. But it's not good again. But swords aren't good against spears. Should we risk it? I don't know if we should risk it. No, after all this, I'm not risking anything. Let's, let's do <laughs> Boyd. He's actually he's got an axe. So maybe Boyd, please actually kill. Oh, come on. Okay. Oh! Mmm, that almost went really bad. But now that he's at one, I trust Ike to deliver the finishing blow here. Yeah. Use the regal one, we haven't used it yet. I will, I will not allow you to take one step more. And I've no choice but to cut you down and walk over you. Oh, that! Now that line is amazing. Oh, my life ends here, but though you flee to Galia, you will fall to die. Ike. Sudden badass. What, wait, that line went so hard. <laughs> By the way, can we just talk about that? Um, I'll get rid of this line, because it's almost done anyway. Because we need, I I'm keeping the short spear for someone. <laughs> Eh, let's let somebody escape, might as well. Go, Oscar, escape. I'm going to ride ahead, Ike. 
I want to see if there are more you know, enemy units ahead. Soren cannot. Soren is, is okay. Oh well. Player phase, and finally we go and finish this. Time to get out of here. I don't know how, but we made it. Brother, hey, you're okay. My Lord Ike, Miss Princess Rolf, are you all well? Yep, we're fine. Is this Gallia? We made it, didn't we? We're safe now, right? I thought I would feel different, but I don't. This is all due to your efforts. Thank you. Princess Valencia. It's still too early to rest easy. The others haven't rejoined us yet. Ah! We are taking- we are talking about the commander. I don't think there's anything to worry about. Father, Shinon, Gaytree. Princess Alencia, I'm afraid we're going to have to part ways here. What- what do you mean? We're going to- we're, we're going back to aid our companions. So I want you to continue with Mr. The Royal Palace of Gallia. What? No, I, I'm going to stay with you! Listen to me, Mist. We must do it this way so that everyone gets out of here alive. Mm -hmm. Father and I will catch up to you right away. Don't worry. A father or I ever broken a promise to you? That's not foreboding or anything. <laughs> oh boy. Well, no. Alright then. We'll go ahead. Thank you, Mist. We'll see you soon. Alright, Titania. Please take care of my brother. Promise? Yeah, my word on it. Aww. Oscar, Boyd, don't get killed out there, alright? I sure hope I don't get them killed. I'll try. <laughs> I'll try not to. Rolf. Knock it off, both of you. You're like a couple of old women. We're gonna be fine. Nothing bad's gonna happen while I'm around. You're one of the ones who've died before. Alright, we're going to go now. Good luck. Watch your step and be careful. We'll see all of you again. I'm sure of it. I know you will all be safe. Let's get moving. Where to, Soren? We go east on the road we used before. Let's find the commander before the enemy reinforcements show up. And that's it for today's episode. So next time... We head off to find and help Grail, hopefully. See you all then, on the next episode of Fire Emblem Path of Radiance.